January 2012, Core 4, Question 3. We're asked to rewrite the expression for t in the form r sine t plus alpha. We're going to start by expanding r sine t plus alpha, and that's sine t cosine alpha plus cos t sine alpha. I'm now going to have to look at my coefficients. I have 15 sine t and r sine t cos alpha. So that tells me that r cos alpha is 15. We have 20 cos t and r cos t sine alpha. So that tells me that r sine alpha is 20. r will be the square root of 15 squared plus 20 squared, which gives us 25. And the tan of alpha will be 20 over 15, so alpha is 0 0.92729. So we can say that we have 25 sine t plus 0 0.9273 sf. You have to be really careful, this angle must be in radians. Part 2, we're asked for the maximum value, and the maximum value that sine can take is 1. So the maximum value of this is 25, i.e. the sine of t plus 0.92729 is 1. And that occurs when sine, or the angle, is 90 degrees, which in radians is pi over 2. So t will be pi over 2 minus or 0.92729, which is 0 0.6435, 0 0.6445 seconds to 3SF.